so in 2016, my mate, um, one of my best mates actually did um, did the marathon for, for a bone cancer charity. Before that, I'd kind of had absolutely no intention to, to ever do any sort of running, certainly not a marathon, but just going up and supporting him the whole buzz of the day, it's just, it's it's absolutely incredible. Like it's, for me, there's nothing that kind of really compares to it. I've not, I not go to football and see the atmosphere there, but the atmosphere of the, the London Marathon is just absolutely incredible. And, and watching Sam run, it was just like, I want to be a part of this in, in, in some sort of way. So, you know, he, he inspired me. And then the year later in 2017, I applied for the ballot for, for the first time, didn't get in through the ballot um, and kind of always knew that if I, if, I, if I ever did end up doing some sort of charity thing, it would always be for the hospice. And I thought, you know, why not get involved and have the buzz of the marathon and, you know, raise, raise money for the hospice at, at the same time. It was amazing, but painful. I, I got through to sort of halfway through and my knees um, weren't great. But yeah, get, getting through and just having the whole buzz of the crowds, you know, seeing my friends, family, seeing the hospice cheer station, it just kind of gets you all through. And as I say, it's just a massive buzz. So as part of the second marathon that I've done, I've raised um, in total 23 and a half thousand. And the, the biggest earner from, from that, I'd, I'd organised a black tyre charity charity ball. As part of that, we did um, an auction. So we got 7,000 pounds of, of that from, from an auction. And that was really relying on people's generosity to, to donate the prizes in the, in the first instance and then bid on the, the prizes that <laughs> some of them were actually bidding on the prizes they donated to um, to raise money for, for that. It was just such a great night and, and raised £14,000 just, just from that black tie charity ball. Um, so that was obviously the biggest earner. I, I didn't think I'd kind of ever get to, to these sort of amounts and I'd hopefully um, in the future get, get to a lot more, but it is just kind of an overwhelming sense of, of pride really. Like I don't kind of normally let myself kind of I don't big myself up too much at all, but I, I, I do just feel amazingly proud of, 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 of what I've done and hopefully will we'll continue to do as well.